Welcome to your workout. Today we'll be doing an eight minute core challenge. My name is Allie Fry or Fit by Fry on Instagram. I also have my own workout platform, AllieFry.com. Be sure to check it out after this video. Let's go ahead and meet on our mat. We'll start in a high plank pose. We'll start by flowing cow and cat pose. Inhale, open your chest. Exhale, press your mat away. Make your way to your neutral tabletop and step into your high plank pose. Stack your shoulders over your wrists. Pull your heels over your toes. Lower your hips and then pull low belly up to spine. We're going to shift it forward and back to the beat of that music. So it's inhales as you shift it forward and exhales as you pull it back while you do so. Stay strong through your bicep. Keep that micro bend. Actively engage your core. From here, it's a shoulder tap alternating right and left. So it's right, center, left, center. It's an exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale. Let's go four more. Three, we're going right knee to right elbow. Eight counts. So it's eight. That's seven, squeezing through that right oblique. Let's take just four more elevators in three. Last two, we're going down and up on that right side. So it's lower lift and squeeze. Inhale, big exhale. Let's go four more in three, opening it up to a side plank. In one, inhale your left arm high as you thread your right ankle through. We're pulling left elbow to right toes. Go ahead and keep those hips high, strong through your right arm, and then refine that beat. So it's pull, open, pull, open. That's an exhale, inhale. Squeezing through that right oblique. We'll take just eight more right here. Let's go eight, seven, in six, we're going back to that high side plank. In four, you're going to thread your right heel behind your left. In one, inhale, left arm high. Lift your hips up. Squeeze through your right oblique. And then we're going to come down onto your right forearm. So let's bring right elbow down to the mat. And then re-lift your left arm. We're threading it under. As you rotate through your side plank, keep your hips up. You can stack those heels. Lift your left fingertips high, pull left shoulder open. Big reach underneath your right side body. From here, we're lowering our right hip down to the mat and rolling onto our back. Last one right here. Lower everything down, lift your shoulders up. Right away, press low back into the mat and then pull right knee in, out, in, out. That's an exhale, inhale, out. Inhale, inhale, keep your left heel hovered. Lift those shoulders. Last four, just three, that's two. And then we're gonna kick that right heel up. So it's pull, lift, lower, down. Pull, lift, lower, down. It's an exhale, and then an inhale as you lower. Keep that left heel hovered. Always option to bring it down to the mat. From here, we move into a straight leg scissor kick. We're going to lift left heel up to meet our right and then alternate those legs. Last one right here. So it's right, left, right, left. Big exhales. Let's go four. That's three, reverse tabletop in two. And one, send your heels just out, in, out, in actively pressing low back into the mat last one right here pull your knees into your chest begin to rock and roll yourself up and then back into your high plank pose restack your joints shoulders over wrists lower your hips down and engage that low belly and then we shift it so it's forward back forward back strong through that upper body inhale exhale Last two, shoulder tap it out right here. So it's right, center, left, center. Keep your hips nice and steady. Just four more, left knee to left elbow. We're gonna pull it in eight times, right here. Give me eight, that's seven. In six, you find your elevators. In four, left knee is going down and up. In two, 
and one. Let's take it down, up, lower, lift. Big squeeze through that left oblique. Let's go four more, just three. Final two, side plank on the other side. Inhale your right arm high, thread your left heel through. And then bring your right fingertips to your ear. We're going right elbow to left toes. Find the beat. And then we pull it in, out, in, out. Big exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale. Relift those hips, squeeze your oblique. Stay open through your chest. You have eight more, that's seven. In six, we come back to our high side plank in four. Just three, threading your left heel through in one. Open up your right fingertips and then stack your heels, lift your hips. On your exhale, come down to your side forearm plank, left elbow to the mat. And then we reach it under, find that rotating side plank. Inhale, lift, exhale, reach under. Keep your hips lifted, open through your chest, pull your shoulder back. Big reach. Almost through this, and then we bring left hips down to the mat. We're gonna roll it onto our back. Shoulders lifted, low back down, and then left knee pulls in, out, in, out, that's an exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale. Hover your right ankle away from the mat. Actively pull low belly down. Let's go eight. Last seven. In six, you're gonna kick your left heel high for that variation, four more. That's three, kick it up in two, and one looks like this. So let's pull, lift, lower, down. That's pull, lift, lower, down. Keep that right heel up, extend, find the length. From here we find our alternating scissor kick. This time we're going to bend our knees alternating. Last two, final one, and then kick your right heel up to me. So let's pull them alternating right, left, right, left. It's an exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale. Let's go eight, six, that's four, three, two, find a reverse tabletop, heels three inches out, three inches in, big squeeze through that low belly, just four, three, last two, kick both heels up the wall and then lower them down for a straight leg lift, big finish right here, this is your second to last change, inhales as you lower, exhales, use that strong low belly to pull your heels over your hips, inhale, lower it down. Exhale, big lift. Moving into your last change, we're gonna hover those heels three inches away from the mat. You can go ahead and flex your toes up to the ceiling. Then it's out, in, out, in. That's inhale, exhale, so strong. Pull your low belly in, big finish right here. Eight, that's seven. Last six, just five, you got this. Four, do not give up. Last two, and one, hug your knees into your chest. Take a few spinal rolls side to side. Relax your head, neck, and shoulders down. Begin to extend your left leg long as you pull your right knee into your chest. Inhale, give it a squeeze. Exhale for a supine spinal twist. Guide your right knee across your body. Reach your right arm long out to a T. Gaze over your right shoulder. Melt your right shoulder down into the mat. Begin to untwist, inhale, right knee into chest. Exhale, switch out your legs. Inhale, give your left knee a squeeze. On your exhale, we'll take that spinal twist on the other side. Send your left knee across and then reach left arm long. Melt your left shoulder down. Begin to untwist, pull both your knees into your chest. And then rock yourself up to a seat. Bend through your left knee, send your right knee behind you. Inhale, arms come up all the way overhead. Exhale, let's take a gentle side body stretch. Feel this through your obliques. Relax your shoulders away from your ears. Inhale, come back through center. And then switch out those legs. So swing your right knee around, left knee behind. Next, inhale, takes your arms up overhead. Exhale, gentle bend. 
option to gaze towards the ceiling bring both your hands down find a comfortable seated position inhale lift your chest exhale let's take our head around to the left two times through and then we'll reverse that direction so send your head around to the right pull your shoulders down last time come through center and give yourself a round of applause